than a normal muffler. That's uh, all to do with the straight pipe. So we're gonna stick this son of a bitch in fucking, uh, probably in, I don't know what that is there, B, probably B1. Now we got this big fucking thing behind it here. We're gonna just step it out of the way. So if anyone was wondering, Amanda has a twin. Antoine got excited oh. when he found out about it. <laughs> uh, fuck. Sounds like you're getting a ride in the deal there. Comes out here for a visit and gets slave labored into knocking dints out of a hood because that's what he does all day at work. <laughs> Oh, fuck, that's nice. <laughs> Austin, the professional auto body guy here. It's gonna be the nicest foot of all of them. Gonna have to give you a nickname like the painting guy on Welkers there, Dr. Strange Love or whatever they call him. <laughs> Already done. Yep. Has he got the 4630? Stickers done? Yeah. Yes. Who's phoning you now? Jesus. Oh. Anyway. So. Supper's ready. Okay. <laughs> so that, that is Amanda's twin brother. What's your name again? Anthony? No. <laughs> Austin. <laughs> um, he's the auto body guy, so he knows his shit there. He just, he's fresh out of school yesterday, so. <laughs> he, uh, come and showed me the right way to paint. And, uh, we got all, all of these all nice and shiny and green, so. Now he's just cleaning up the gun, and we'll put everything away, and let things dry I guess so come back tomorrow and see how it turns out well it's a few days later from when Austin was here and we painted that hood it uh, it's uh, summertime weather outside again so I haven't been doing too much inside the shop here I've been uh, Mostly outside doing things, but uh, <clears throat> came here earlier this morning, and I want to try and get some stuff squared away in here, and maybe have a video of painting that way. So, ah, uh, these are all the parts I've got done. 
masked off and painted. There's the fuel filter housing and a whole bunch of covers and caps and the that big hydraulic block that goes up there and then goes to your steering. Oil filter housing, uh, timing cover, water jacket, little oil cooler piece. Injection lines, ether line, bracket trees and intake pipe and more pipes and hoses and turbocharge line and the nose, PTO cover, something else. Yeah, whatever. Another hose. <laughs> so, i just done a little bit of touch-ups on a few of them. We have left on the little table here is the oil cooler itself. And somehow these little guys, but I'm thinking I'm going to just leave them till the tractor's together. And I'll just touch them up with a brush. Because there's way too much stuff to try to put tape on on them so we'll just cut new hoses put it together call her happy ah what else lots of stuff to mask off and ah just all kinds of fun anyway I'm gonna do some cleaning up here too because things are kind of a fucking disaster so <laughs> Anyway, I guess we'll talk to you here in a few. Well, I put one of the decals on here. I need the nose piece. I just put another shot of paint on it. That uh, fiberglass really absorbs it, so. Uh, it should be good now, I think. And then uh, we'll bolt that back on and... Should be able to put the rest of the stickers on. I'm trying to figure them out though. He done it a little bit different than uh, other ones that I've had him do. I'm going to have to figure out what pieces here. Oops. What pieces go where? We've got these real two short ones here. Then the 4630s. This length of yellow stripe times three. Sorry, two of them and then two that long. No, right? No, that's a lie. One that long, two that long, two this long, and then the John Deere, so. Oh, I think I noticed something here now. Yes, I see what's going on. Okay. This is going to be a little bit of a puzzle here to put together, but we'll figure it out. <laughs> um, yeah, see how that's got a long piece of yellow behind the John Deere? And that's just a short piece? I'm thinking that's going to go there to make it the right length. I'm going to have to get the measuring tape out, but... Yes, ha ha ha, we figured it out. Okay, so that's gonna go there. These are gonna go up at the front somewheres. One of these is gonna wrap around the nose, presumably. How does this line up with one of these? If we put it here. Maybe something like that, and then the 4630 at the front? I don't know. She'll be a puzzle, but we'll figure it out. Something is outside. Dad with the RM gravel truck. Coffee time, he must be coming to have coffee here, so. Anyway, and I was welding on this gate and everything else, but I guess while we wait for things to dry, we'll go find something else to do. Okay, I'm an idiot. I figured it out. Lining it up the same way, but look. It's reversed, obviously, for the other side. There, look. Long yellow stripe on the back and short on the front. So it's the same length. Look, 
I can kind of make it lean here. Bear with me. There, look. It is the same. Figured it out. Very good. Anyway, thought I'd show you that so you weren't all just sitting there thinking, fuck this guy's dumb. <laughs> anyway, that's the other thing too. It's fucking nice out, so I bought a brand new air nailer because we were always just borrowing them before. Figured the amount that we've been using one, I may as well just have one. So I went and got this good old El Cheapo from Co-op. Should be good enough. Put a regulator on it from my dead spray paint gun. And I got a bunch of windbreak that I'm building out there too, so. We'll see, I wanted to make a video of just painting, but it's kind of hard to do if I'm gonna be done painting for the day now, so. We'll see how many minutes we're at, and we'll figure it out. Well, just to kind of show I never know what direction I'm going in a day. They uh, phoned and they want all of our soybeans hauled in starting today. We got the they all week here to haul them in they said so it'll be uh, easy enough we only have uh, uh, 7,300 bushels between mine and Antoine to haul in so only uh, won't be that many trips anyways so anyway I guess I probably won't make her back to painting here now today so probably where I'm gonna leave you guys on that there'll be lots to come though anyways but yeah I guess Thank you much for watching. Make sure you hit the like button, comment, subscribe for more. Talk to all you in the next one.